What's up, everybody? What's up, everyone? How you doing? How you been? So, we just had an amazing weekend. We went to our buddy, Ron, a.k.a. Century the Mad Collector's wedding mm -hmm. with his lovely bride, Caitlin. My new best friend. Shout out to them, but right now, in honor of them, we are right outside of Target, and we're gonna be heading inside, doing what we do best, and that's an amazing, amazing toy hunt. So let's get ready, people. Are you ready? I'm ready. She's ready. Let's go! If they hit me, they hit me. I hope they got good insurance. All right, guys, let's go inside. All right, so we are coming up across this lovely end gap. We got Asia's favorite Jurassic Park. <laughs> you know, she loves her some dinosaurs. Don't you, lovely? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got some Nerf guns. I gotta keep her away from those because she would be tempted. Absolutely. And it'd be over for me. And then we got some of y'all favorites. We have the wrestling section. We have the head of the bloodline, Mr. Roman Reigns. We have Brock Lesnar, Ultimate Edition. <laughs> Molly Holly. Oh, the ultimate warrior. That does not look like the ultimate warrior. Maybe the younger version, I, I guess. AJ Styles. Wow, this is like old school AJ Styles. Well, <laughs> this looks like uh, Bob Backlund almost. Mm -hmm. We got some AEW. We've been so out of the loop, baby. We don't even know what's new, what's old. You know? She looks very happy. Good old Nyla Rose. And we got Red Velvet. You you like the dress from last night? That was Red Velvet. <laughs> Adam Page. More Adam Page. We have some Imperial from uh, Andor. We have Mr. Obi-Wan Kenobi. And Dr. Britt Barker. Much better head sculpt than the last figure we saw. And we got good old Boba Fett. And we got some Star Wars figures. You see Millennium Falcon. We got some Masters of the Universe. We have more Masters. We have, what is, oh, Avatar. Some Avatar figures. All right, got some interesting stuff. Some Toy Story, some more Jurassic World. All throughout this area here. Oh, I see my man Shredder sneaking in the cut. Yeah, you ain't slick, bruh. You ain't slick. Saraton finding no. <laughs> nothing at all. No. You want to have a Mario Kart race? I do. <laughs> Let's get it going. I got the Camaro right down there. You say you got the what? Got the police car. You, you're taking up after your mother, aren't you? Yeah. Police <laughs> car. Can't race with you. She want to be police. <laughs> all right. Got some Pokemon figures. It looks like they've. Uh, get those walkie-talkies. <laughs> so like they stepped their game with some of this Pokemon stuff. Oh, shoot. Look at Lucario. Now this is dope. Wow. I, I did not know this was a thing. <laughs> it's actually really, really amazing. Light up affects you better for that price point. She found herself a Yoshi. Yoshi! And now we found ourselves with the Transformers Slash McFarlane figures. Hey, babe, look, it's the build a horse you wanted. I love the build the horse. <laughs> you like the Joker? I like the horse. <laughs> All right, we got a uh, Earth Spark Transformers. All right, this must be a new line or a line I just haven't seen. Haha, <laughs> Galvatron. It's dope. Oh, got the Black Ranger. Is that Adam? I think that's Adam's Black Ranger, right? Yeah, that's cool. Alright, here's some G.I. Joe classified. Are these things still popular? I'm not sure. I, listen, we're out of the loop, guys. Ooh! Look at that, Duke Thomas. I haven't seen this. Here's your dope. We got some more G.I. Joe, three and three quarters. We got Nasty Luther. And we got our Devastator versus good old Soups. Who's ready for some Dungeons and Dragons? Who would have thought freaking Stranger Things would have brought this thing back? 
in mm-hmm. full effect. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the reason why it's it's even this popular right now. Uh, Ninja Storm. I miss this era. When in Target, get yourself a Target truck. This is new. Haven't seen this. And it comes with a cart that people are going to leave out on the road anyway. This is from Fast and Furious 18. They'll have the 2020 Jeep <laughs> Gladiator. <laughs> Let's take a look at this lovely Eevee right here. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's cool. See, exactly. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got Charmander. You got Pikachu. You got Butterfree. And you got the Pokeball. I was about to catch them all. <laughs> oh, Dragon Knight. Dragon Air. Dragon. Dragon. Dragon Dragon? I've. Dragonite. Dragonite. See, I'm not. It was a little out of touch. It was a little out of touch. Not that much out of touch. And the area that I don't know if anybody's really into these anymore. I, I don't hear too much Lego talk anymore. I remember uh, Seth used to dread the whole Lego talk. But is this still a thing, guys? You know, we've been, like I said, out of the loop with, you know, toy hunting. So let us know down below. Is this still a thing? Is this still a... Is this something that you guys are still into? Huh? 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 I know some of y'all be ready to run your own fashion yeah, show. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know y'all. Y'all down with all this right here. L-O-L-O-M-G. Too many acronyms going on right now. <laughs> Way too many. And I seen you get that. Oh, hold on. She's found her some. Oh, Cat Noir. Who is played by Mr. Inosuke. Yes. Yeah, yeah. that's right. And look, Okoye Ibambe. So one thing I haven't noticed at this Target is that I haven't found the anime section. Normally they have like the little, the little anime action figures and stuff and I haven't seen that. So Maybe it's by the electronics? It could be. Most of them usually do have them in separate areas. So we're gonna take a quick little walk around a little bit more, uh, see what else this Target has, and we'll get back with you in a second. It's the power of editing. For you, it would be like a split second. For us, it'd probably be like ten minutes, especially when I'm with this one at Target. <laughs> see you guys. In- As we were walking through, we came across this lovely manga section which looks like it has a lot more up-to-date manga than a lot of the other targets we've been to they even have spy family yeah, i think they have the whole run yeah one two three four five six seven eight that's rare because most targets it's always like one and seven and nine and that's it we got chainsaw man uh i don't see five so it's one, two, three, four, five, and six is missing, and eight. Oh, that sucks. But I mean, like I said, they have a lot more run than you got Sailor Moon down here. So that's pretty cool. Attack on Titan. Oh, she she found her. She found her. Who? Oh, Haikuyu. Yes. Still gotta finish that. Yeah, we showed them a little bit of Jujutsu. One. One Piece mod. This is probably one of the most recent ones, right? Yeah. Oh, this is probably when uh, Ace, you know... Oh, this is Wano. Why is Ace in the front, though? Because um, in Wano, he um, Luffy meets somebody that was highly impacted by Ace. So there's a lot of flashbacks with Ace in it. Ah, look at you, One Piece. This is, this is my One Piece guru right here. Thank you. When I need When I need that One Piece talk, I gotta go to her. Or else she don't give me that talk. I'm going to give her that one punch. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> no, I don't. I don't. <laughs> she, If anything, she knocks me out. It's the other way around. <laughs> That's cool, though. There's Anya in the cover of this. Look, babe, look, Anya's in the cover of this. All right. Uh, so we're still in the hunt right now for the anime slash collectible area. We still haven't come across that yet. So stay tuned. We'll be back in a sec manga talk so we've located two pops from target con that's another section we haven't noticed or found yet our funko pops but there is hope they they do they are around here somewhere 
Hmm. We just don't know where. <laughs> These are pretty cool though. Mm -hmm. From the No Way Home line. That was a really great movie. All right, the hunt continues. We wouldn't be toy hunters if we weren't out hunting for stuff. So, mm -hmm. give us a sec, guys. We'll find it. You know we will. In the midst of walking back and trying to find where these pops and other stuff are located, completely missed these helmets. And this big avatar figure. And this three pack of Masters of the Universe. See? As toy collectors, we miss things sometimes. We ain't perfect. But, playing right. Oh, Candyland. I remember. I noticed that too. I loved playing this game as a kid. I don't know why. Fortnite. See, I don't even think we saw the Fortnite stuff either. Uh, look at this. Got Menace. And then we have Drift Mask. And then we have a lone G.I. Joe soldier or a police, sir. But yes, I do not see any Funko related or other collectibles. So this is where you admit defeat and try to ask somebody where they are or do you just say, all right, well, didn't find it. So it is what it is. If they place it somewhere, they place it somewhere good. All right, well, it may be it for this location. I don't know, I think we're just gonna take a look to see what else they have left in the store I mean the mall is kind of right in front of us and by right in front of us I mean it's literally dead away she's, she's hungry oh, uh, instead of oh wait it went back to normal so now I can zoom in on the screen okay this gimbal is messing with me today all right so we're gonna get some food and then continue off with our day. So, catch you guys in a bit. We out. So, we're inside the mall. We came across this place called Five Wits. And it has Drago's Castle, Deep Space, and Tomb. So, this must be like some interesting, like, adventure type thing. Is it an escape room? If it is, it might be some form of it. it must be like a maze of some sort. Look at the gears. This is dope. GameStop for the win? Let's check it out. All right, what we got here? What we got here? Oh, we got Shuri from Wakanda Forever. We got Sir Mix-a-Lot because he likes big butts and he cannot lie. All right, that's enough. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that. I didn't even know he was out yet. We got Batman Hush. Yeah, I've seen him a few times. That's funny. What else we got? What else we got? What else we got? Oh, there goes the Hokages. A whole lot of Toby Ramas. So, it's quite interesting in that regard. Yeah, this nice Nami. We got Chopper. We got Mr. Itadori. We have Zoro. Oh, oh, yeah, she didn't see that part. Yeah, look at her. Her whole neck broke just now. <laughs> Her whole neck up. Oh, gear for Luffy. They have a lot of good stuff here. Ah. Uh, and the mask. Yeah. Ooh, and then Luffy right above him. Yeah. There's another Luffy right here. They have a lot more in this game stuff than all of our game stuffs combined. This is true. <laughs> this is crazy. And then we got the 18 inch All Might. Can't get enough of all mites, I guess. Oh, there's a pop tea that's been eluding me for forever. <laughs> GameStop had to actually cancel mine because they never received theirs. But oddly enough, this location has them. Several of them. You also have Pain. And we got Hero Jack or Airphone Jack. Is that her name? Can't remember. I didn't even know GameStop had their own exclusive AEW figures. Look at that. Nick Jackson. Look at that storm. I didn't see. Oh, well, that one I've seen. Black Lantern Superman. What is I, I, I'm so out of the loop. But this one's the most impressive one. Like I've never seen or heard of this. I'm sure 
people who get AEW figures know about this. Alright, well, that's it for GameStop, and uh, we'll see what else is in store. Very fruitful. I'm sorry, what was that, madam? I said a very fruitful observation. Indeed. Oh, you saw this evening? Yeah, it's so, like so Gear 4 Luffy. <laughs> look how big he is, and look how small the hat is. <laughs> it's amazing it stays around his neck. <laughs> Alright, guys, see you in a bit. Here comes Barnes and Noble. There's a Starbucks and Target. There's a Starbucks and Barnes and Noble. There's a Starbucks and probably in this mall somewhere. <laughs> What'd you find there? I found a friend. Hey, did you really? What's his name? I'm not allowed to name him until we buy him because then I get attached. Alright, so we'll see you at the next station. Alright, we found some gold in this Barnes and Noble. It was getting really... Oh, babe. It's Sasuke's uh, SH for you art. Oh my gosh. Look at you, you beautiful man, you. <laughs> On full display. We have some, oh, some more stuff. Huh, we have Kiba and Akamaru. Uh, I don't know what show you're from. So apologize for that. Huh, RuPaul. You got Deku. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know where that's from. Uh, we got some more stuff here. We got some Demon Slayer. We got Dragon Ball. More Dragon Ball down here and Demon Slayer. We got a lot of Demon Slayer minis. Cowboy Bebop, SH Figure Art. Some Gundam. We got some mangas on the wall here. And it looks like they have a lot of prize stuff back here. So here they keep all their you know, really good stuff back behind the wall. Hmm. See Zenitsu. See Tanjiro. Uh, we got some model kits here. We have Boba Fett. Some cute poskets. Uh, what else we got? Look at this. Look at all the SH figure arts in the back here. And some more mangas. Oh, they even have basketball and baseball cards. And wrestling. And Pokemon. This Barnes and Noble is like literally top notch. Shout out to this one. And they have some more Legos here. And some here. And then, you know, little board games and stuff. This Barnes & Noble, guys, has way more than any Barnes & Noble I've ever seen. So, Palisades, Barnes & Noble for the win. I will definitely say she's over here playing with stuff. This is called Smart Ass. Okay. <laughs> you written all over it. <laughs> It's interesting. Avocado, game. avocado is the name of the game. <laughs> All right, guys. I think we're going to conclude our visit to Barnes & Noble. No, I wish we could have bought one of these games and played. That would be fun. <laughs> All right. We'll see where this visit takes us. See you guys in a bit. Okay, so I lied. This is not the end because we found some Funko Pops. Babe, look. Care Bears are back. You got to get it. No, that's a dark, dark rabbit hole. <laughs> oh, we got Aaron. Love me some Attack on Titans. Snoop Dogg. Where's Snoop? Did I miss him? Oh, wow, I really didn't. Snoop Dogg. Another Snoop Dogg. Yeah. <laughs> Black Adam. Ooh, Mikasa, one of my favorites. Bertold, you bum. Ymir and her Titan. Hawkeye, which I still haven't watched that show. Dune and that's it BTS I don't know what, anything about that stuff that's the goat right there oh, we got Oswald the Lucky Rabbit look at that Disney classic last but not least is Blink 182 see my man Travis you see you Travis oh look they got many Tamagotchis of Jujutsu Kaisen Demon Slayer oh let's go Tanjiro what else? Who's back here? Another um, Jujutsu Kaisen. Oh, uh, yeah. 
Oh, that's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Maybe one of these days we might look into those. All right, now for sure we're we're, we're taking off from Barnes and Noble. All right, we're done. That's it. See you in a bit. All right, guys. So we have met with our homeboy Amit. We might have met him over from uh, Century's videos. Let me wave again. But we are. <laughs> <laughs> so we're heading to Newberry Comics in the Palisades Mall. And hey, guys, it's gonna be crazy. So let's see what they got. such a disappointment so now guys we are here at Target I mean ooh, we are here at Toys R Us inside of Macy's and uh, I must say this is a major letdown Hug, babe. super pets <laughs> we got some uh, oh, nice little figures here 
I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not, I'm not thrilled. Hearing, you know, people talk about Toys R Us coming back and putting them into Macy's and I kind of feel like this is like Toys R Us Express, like you would get in one of those stores. He ain't lying. That's right. Ah, it's like BattleBots. Yes. Like it. I guess this is the one cool thing we've seen so far. Yeah, like, I think it's because we're comparing it to Toys R Us that we grew up on. Bro, you didn't want to leave. You just, you just didn't want to leave. Like, here, right now, I want to leave. <laughs> Sorry. I, I don't find anything exciting about coming to this Toys R Us. Like, now I'm not going to go to any Toys R Us at all. I feel like this is, like, the best Toys R Us that you'd have in the Palisades Mall. And if I go to any other Macy's, it's going to be probably smaller. Like, this is it. This is all that you get. It's like more kids stuff. Well, then there is like, but like there's no video games, there's no action figures, there's no, you know, what Toys R Us had. Like, just none of that. The doggy fell, he, look, 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 look at that, they mistreated the dog. Look, even the dog wants to get out of here. The dog is over it. All right, so I think that's it for this area. I think we have one more location that we're going to check out. Uh, this is probably going to be a long video. Might have to splice it up a bit. Was going to do a two or three parter, but I think we're just going to trim it down and make it nice and slim. So, uh, yeah, one more spot and then I guess we're going to call it. So bear with us, guys. This is a new location for us, you know trying to figure all this stuff out and we will catch you in a bit but yes catch you where catch you on the flip side <laughs> uh, me you got anything you want to say to the people <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back <laughs>
All right, so for our last stop, we are back in Target. We located the section where the pops and action figures are, or collectibles are, thanks to our buddy Amit. And here it is in the front of the store. So yes, here it is. All this hype for probably not gonna find much of anything. Uh, what we got? What we got? What we got? A lot of old and outdated stuff. So yes, we are sorry that we wasted your time. <laughs> uh, they still have uh, quite a few Target Con stuff. But yeah, nothing too exciting. We have She-Hulk, the most exciting thing here. So yeah. Th that is finally it. That was the last of, that was the last of it. We're not gonna do any more. We promise you. <laughs> as far as this is gonna go. Alright, ladies and gents, that is it for our trip to the Palisades. Yes. Uh, we didn't know that the Target here actually connects to the Palisade Mall. So that's why, you know, it starts off in Target and kind of ends up into the Palisades Mall. But then we got back to Target. Because <laughs> <laughs> our car was parked right in the Target parking lot. So but there's a lot of interesting stuff here. We had a lot of fun. We'll definitely um, be back. Definitely we'll be back. We have some things that we didn't get a chance to do. Um, a lot of interesting collectible spots. Uh, it's kind of a little bit of the same, no matter where you go. Um, Newberry Comics, I think, was the most fun. Uh, they had a lot, a lot of collectibles there, so that was good to see. But yes, that is it, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to be heading home. It's going to be an hour and 20 minute drive. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Wish us luck. <laughs> while, while you guys are going to just click off of this video. And I'm going to go for a nap. Yeah. He and drives. I'll be driving. <laughs> so, thank you guys for tuning in. Appreciate the love and support as always. Stay tuned to the next video. But in the meantime, watch this video. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring that bell for the ring a ding ding. Bye, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. I'll see ya. <laughs> Appreciate you guys. Till the next time. Pop and crew, we're out. Peace. <laughs>